Hi everyone, it's Mike. Um, I'm sorry about the noise at the moment. If you can hear that noise, I think some idiot's riding around on a moped or something like that around here. But I've just come out today just for a little walk and I thought I'd do a review of this jacket that I've got on, or this fleece. It is the Bear Grylls Survivor Fleece. I've had this for approximately two or three years now which is a long time and it's been used heavily and hasn't got any damage. In my opinion it is one of the most perfect fleeces you can buy. So what makes it good? Well first of all if you can actually you should be able to see this. It's very um, it has a very fleecy warm texture to it. Same on the inside. And what this does is it keeps you very nice and warm even in very cold temperatures up to say minus 10 if you've got a few layers on underneath it it is not waterproof that is one of the downsides and same it is not windproof but again you would wear another garment for the weather some of the good features about it it has a pocket here which is zippered and meshed on the inside so you can put little bits of gear in there especially like tinder to dry it next to your body heat with the pocket being meshed inside you also have two zipped mesh pockets on either side as well so again it's good for storing little bits of gear in the zipper pulls are all red and orange Bear Girls colours but pretty good due to the fact you can actually see it in the dark and zip it up the zippers are very strong haven't filled me yet. So, a few other features as you can see here. It is the stretch material again, and that's all the way up your stress points on either side. And then on your forearm, you have a rough material around your elbow. If you can see that there, real rough material on the stress points there. And the final feature of this is the draw cord at the bottom so that you can cinch the actual fleece down to keep the heat in around your waist. Bear Grylls um, gear is becoming very popular. Whether you like him or not, I don't think it really makes that much of a difference because it's his gear. It's designed either by Craghoppers for the clothing or Gerber for the actual gear and any problems they've had or anything like that with it being Gerber or Craghoppers have sorted it out and whichever way you go Grills was actually in the SAS and there's been trained like that whether you like his TV show or not he does know what he's on about he has to know what he's on about so this is why I think his gear is so good so Thanks for watching guys, I really recommend this fleece, stay tuned, I'll see you on the next video.